Hey everybody, it's time for another episode of FTL. So, let's start a new game. We still haven't beaten the game with a Kestrel, which is annoying. And you know what, for the sake of it, since I unlocked this on stream, it's still a Kestrel. But, we'll, uh, we'll do something different. Well, let's see. I don't think I, oh wait, hang on. There we go. Uh, I don't think I've done this reference on. Uh, oh, no, that that gave it away. Damn it! Oh well. Uh, D'Artagnan, Samson, Goldie, and Calvin. And just for the sake of it. Rename to Candyland. Unfortunately, I gave away what I'm referencing. Um, what in the hell? My game is lagging. What the fuck? Whatever, we're gonna deal with this. It's going to be choppy as hell, and I'm sorry, but... Um, yeah, we just have to deal with that. Okay, so, one, two, three, four. I like the Kestrel B from what I've seen on Cobalt Streak's stream. It has four basic lasers to start. And, yeah, you can just take things out. Oh, wow, they start fires as well. That's awesome. Take out the cockpit. Not that it matters. This has one of the strongest starts of any ship in the game, as far as I know. Oh man. This is playing kind of slow. Hmm. It may be that I need to reboot my computer, but hey. Okay. Take out the weapon, actually. Eh, that's annoying, but now it won't dodge these. Probably could have done with aiming for the cloaking, to be honest. Make sure that it wouldn't just waste extra time. Because wasting extra time is annoying. Oh boy, a chain ion, that is great. Let's see, we should probably get these doors sorted right away, and then our next upgrade will probably be for the, um, the weapons. Let's see, we will search, oh hey, free combat drone mark 2. It's not something I really intend to use, but it sells for a pretty penny, that's for sure. We will intervene. Oh god, my shields. And my oxygen. <laughs> god. If any of you have been around the stream, you know that me leaving my oxygen off is... very often what gets a lot of my crew killed. A lot of, if not all of, my crew. It's pretty bad. I need to get in the habit of actually looking at that garbage. We should be okay for now. By the way, if you uh, if you hear me humming things that uh, that aren't in the game music, it's because I'm not listening to the game music. I actually have my game sound muted. You guys can hear it, but uh, in my mixer, I have it turned completely off just because I wanted to listen to the Kill the Kill soundtrack. Which, by the way, if anybody has any anime recommendations for this uh, current season, definitely let me know. Um, bearing in mind that I am already watching um, No Game, No Life and uh, Hitsugi no Chaika. 
because they are both very interesting. Very relevant to my interests. No Game No Life being about a pair of neat siblings, and that's neat spelled N-E-E-T. Uh, playing video games, and they're so good at them that they get basically summoned into this gaming world where um, everything is based on games. And if you, if you, um, actually, whoa, it's one thing about not having the game sound is you don't know when you're on fire. Um, anyways, they get, oh my god, we're even on more fire. Run! Dude, he just moonwalked a little. Uh... They're so good, they get dragged into this game world, and then everything in the world is, like, based on betting in the games that you can make up on the spot if you want. And all bets are final. All bets must be uh, upheld. All the rules of each game must be followed, everything. So, like, basically, within the second episode, the main character's goal is to become king of, like, where he landed. It's great. I like it a lot. Oh my god. With the game lag, this is going to take for friggin' ever. <sighs> we need those sh shields up, though. And then Samson needs some heals. Uh, nick me. Uh, you are actually going to be renamed... Steven. I'm not sure if that's how they spelled Steven in that movie, but... There you go. Uh, I'm not sure what I'll be doing for weapons. My weapons are already very strong. They're certainly not flagship handling strong, but... You know, we're in a good spot already. With the start that we're given with the red tail. Let's see what the store has in store. Oh, shield charge booster is good for defense. It's not something I'm super keen on, though. Chain ion is... Pretty nice, though. Unfortunately, it takes a lot to power that. That I'm getting rid of. Uh, let me see. If I was to upgrade by 2, that would be 125 plus 50. 175 to power the chain ion while still keeping 3 basic lasers. And it would cost... Let's see, it would be 2 plus 3 would be 5, so it would be 50 plus 25 would be 75 plus the cost of, well, no, th it, this doesn't cost anything. Um, hmm, I could think of worse things. So, you know what? Let's, uh... Let's sell these, and then we will go, we'll do that. Uh, actually, let me put the chain ion in the back. That way it has some buffer between itself and the basic lasers. Fight the ship. Okay. Chain ion's gonna go there, the basic lasers are also gonna go there. Because they have nothing else that's threatening me. Let's get this song, I don't want to listen to it. Cool. Gamagori's theme and non on theme. Neat. Unfortunately, I can't put the songs in the video for you guys. Um, I'm sure most people wouldn't want to hear it anyways. They'd probably just want to listen to the game music, which is fair enough. You came here for game footage and... Whoops. 
game sound goes along with the game footage, so I'm compromising not hearing the game for uh, you guys not having to hear my music, if that makes sense. I don't think that made much sense. It didn't make much sense to me. <laughs> oh, chain, chain ion, please. Is that the full four damage now? I think it is. Oh, got him. Right before the jump. Nice. We gotta go, or else we're gonna be tarped. Uh, one drone part for seven fuel. Sure, I'll do that trade all day. Uh, let's see here. We will go... Uh, we've got the fuel. Let's go, Nebula. Nebula's gonna be annoying with, like, ion storms, but apart from that, we're gonna be looking pretty good, actually. Uh, I have the crew. Yeah, that was a 50-50 chance. As unlikely as it seems for that event, it's a 50-50, and I like those odds. Uh, six fuel for 12 scrap. We're not going to get a better price than that, so we'll do it. And this is a dead jump, which is annoying, but hey. What can we do? Not much. This, we should still wind up profiting in this. Hey. Cool, I'll trade a Zoltan, or I'll trade a Mantis for a Zoltan most of the time. Just because... Mantis are nice for when you get boarded, but so is fighting in the mid bay. And I don't intend to go with boarding strats on this ship, so there's no point really. Okay. Uh, no. We'll chain eye on the shields and stick to smashing the weapons up. Reason for chain ironing the shields is uh, just so you know they take the most uh, just so they take the longest between being up, uh, up and down. Oops, Reinhardt, your station never actually got saved, sir. Save stations. Okay, we should be well beyond good on this ship by now. They had no crew teleporter. That would have actually been really unfortunate. And it's probably something I'll need to worry about later. I'll just need to look and pay a good amount of attention to whether they have a crew teleporter. Which means I'm probably going to die. Because, you know, paying attention is not one of my strong suits. Especially not in this game. Which is bad, because... It should be a lot better in this game. Uh, yeah, let's just skirt this line as closely as... Oh, God. That was poor decision-making. Okay. Take that off, because we can't afford the power. Mm. Yeah, we can afford one shield. And they can only afford one weapon. So, you're good, actually. Let's go ahead and hit that drone control. That thing's gonna be really annoying. Not the biggest deal that it's got. You better be kidding. Okay. No! Please stop doing that. Okay, there we go. That's what I wanted. Hit these shields. That weapon is of absolutely no threat to me. And they don't even have a second weapon, so. Even that's not a big deal. Hmm. I'm trying to think. Uh, you know what? We don't need the engines, because if we... We can get hit 100% of the time. And it doesn't affect us at all. Because that single laser is never going to get through my shield. No, that's not enough. 
Yeah, this is going to take long, but we're in no danger whatsoever. It's fine. Ion storm storms are annoying, but if you've got the extra power, it's a huge deal. Yay. It's more than what they were originally offering. Uh, let's get rid of that. And now we can jump. Uh, may as well zigzag as much as possible. Why not? Power up all the weapons, and, whoops, chain ion the shields, ooh, that's ugly. Maybe we get through and maybe we damage the weapons and maybe they have their missile out front instead, ah, darn. Okay, I don't think we're on fire, I can't hear it, but if we are... That will have gotten rid of it. Should have done by now. But, you know, I don't know what the timing is on fire going out, and I also don't know the, um... Uh, what, uh... I don't have the sound cue... ...to know whether the fire is still burning. Mmm, we could go for some upgrades, but there's no point. Oh dear. Okay, we can... We can likely do the same thing we did before, because that heavy laser is not... Um, it's not powered. So that's a burst one, I think. So, I don't think we need the engines right now. Uh, yeah, it's a burst one. Then we take one whole damage. Not the hugest deal. We should... Yeah, there we go. Yep, we're good now. Those weapons are likely not to come up again. We will continue to chain ion their shields, and actually I'm going to switch the basic lasers to over to the shields. I will only switch it back to the weapons if I see the weapons come back online. That's a lot of fuel, but not enough scrap. I'm sorry. Not sorry. I mean, it, looks, it looked like the uh, heavy laser was the one they switched to when I knocked out the power on the burst one, which is weird, because I would think they take the same amount of power. But, at any rate, battle's over. We only took one whole damage that whole fight, so. Unpower that, power that up. We taken damage. Hang on, let me just go throughout the ship really quick. Should be fine, but we just need to patrol to make sure. Okay, back to your spot. Okay. We'll go this way, then down, then over. And we've got all our power back. Attack the pirate. Uh, whoops. One and three. Okay, same deal we've been doing. One on the shields, two and three on the weapons. And I somehow didn't realize that we had our shields upgraded, but this is pretty much the same ship as before. Just slightly more threatening because it can actually power both weapons. And now that we have one of their weapons down, it is not a threat at all. Can't even keep that weapon up. 
As long as not both weapons are firing in quick succession to one another and they don't all hit at once, we can't take damage here. So, non threatening. Always glad when enemies have laser weapons only and not missiles. It's one of the biggest problems with the flagship is that it has a triple missile launcher. Kinda really sucks. I almost think after I have the chain ion charged I should switch its target, but... Meh. Cool. God, I'm knocked out. And I don't think I'm going to be spending any scrap until I come across something worth spending it on. I'm not sure that I have three jumps in me without getting trapped at the exit, so I won't risk it too much. Chain ion on the shields. Oh boy, they just have an ion blast one. We are completely fine. And a beam drone. There was no way they were even going to get close to coming through our shields. That's awesome. Um, I'm actually going to set these to that. Because there is no real reason for me to have it on the shield, or on the weapons anyways. The weapons were no threat at all. Even with the drone helping, because the drone doesn't do shield damage. So just everything on the shields to take them down. Don't really need much else in the way of DPS. Even that weapon coming back up at the end was no threat. Ooh, stun bomb. Huh. Mm -mm. Don't know. Hull beam is nice. Oh man, the weapon's pre igniter. It's not something you pass up. Um, I think we just sell this stun bomb because we don't really need it. And then we get cloaking. Because cloaking is awesome. And we don't need anything else, so hey. Jump to the exit. And I'd say we're in a pretty good spot already. And let's go hostile. No reason to keep it green when we have the fuel to not... And we have the hole to not bother with friendly sectors. Gotta worry about it. Hail him. Oh, no, I'm sorry. We'll not be... We won't be trading for missiles anytime soon. I don't plan on using missile weapons. Anytime soon, if at all. Okay. Get the chain ion going. And... Basic lasers. Nice. Already doing good work. For anyone who doesn't know by now, the uh, weapon pre-igniter just makes it so your weapons fire immediate, or they're able to be fired immediately upon entering combat. Extremely good for getting a damage lead. Okay. It's the only place we can jump to that isn't a dead jump, and it just is coincidentally the best thing we could have done. Nice. I could probably fire those earlier, actually. But, um. I don't know. 
like, I could fire them while the Ion Blast is actually going toward its target. Doesn't really matter, though. So glad that's not a Defense Drone Mark II, because it would actually shoot down my projectiles. Uh, yeah, I'll take that. That's a lot of fuel. I'll hit both of these Distress Beacons. Take the drones. If anything, I'll want to get, like, hacking or something. I won't go to the Distress Beacon quite yet. Nice. That miss was annoying, but at least it didn't hit a shield. That's basically what I was worried about originally when I wasn't firing the basic lasers. I probably should get a little bit out of the habit of auto-firing. Just because auto-fire can potentially kind of screw you. I gotta, in, I gotta remember to install the um, Better Backgrounds and Planets mod. It looks very pretty. It might be a little bit too visually distracting though. Two hull damage, it's not a big deal. Just get repairing. It's not until I move my crew members that I remember that this game is lagging horribly. Okay. Back to your places. Ah, I forgot to rename Reinhardt. Your name will be Lil Jody, who was punished for breaking eggs. Uh, let's bring it aboard. Oh dear. Okay, get in the med bay. You'll be fine. Um, hmm. Uh, they have a basic laser and ion blast. I think that may be an ion blast too. If so, that kinda sucks. It's not a huge deal though. Okay. We're gonna be fine. Um, right. Uh, hmm. No, an Ion 2 can't. I don't think he can tear through shields that fast. Uh, screw it. Let's just go all on weapons. Even if it can, we can just cloak anyways. But we seem to be pretty fine. Eh, still managed to get hit. That's unfortunate. Oh, they're all gonna die without even breaking a single thing. Nice. Easy. No, we won't accept that surrender. Oh no, they're jumping. That's unfortunate. Oh well. Um. No, we're gonna get trapped if we don't go to the exit right now. Uh, no, I don't need those drone parts that badly. Let's go for. Um. Let's be ballsy. Let's go this way. Uh, I'm actually going to max out cloaking right now. I, or wait, wait. Okay, we're not near. We're not near a store. Um, max out cloaking. Just cause is really good. Okay. Uh, sure, I'll give you fuel. 56 scrap. Nice. Let's go this way. 
I'm not discovering many new points if I jump to this spot that was right next to me. Okay, chain eye on that. Okay. Ugh, mind control is so annoying. They won't be able to get through our shields if I play this right. You need to repair that, jerk. Nice, we're up to three ion damage. Not bad. I don't care if their ion weapon is up. Mmm, sure. We'll take the fuel where we can get it for the next sector or so. Mmm. Ah. When I have the chance, I will upgrade my reactor one more time, just because managing power while moving Zoltans around is a little bit annoying. Okay, cool. I'm friendly. Thank you for the supplies. Uh, reactor. One. Cool. Nice distress beacon. Should be profitable for us in some way. Oh boy, it was an ambush. That's fine. We can just cloak away from their burst too. game is still not running at 100% speed. It's annoying. Nice. Uh, they still have a decent chance of getting through my shields, but we'll only take a single point of hull damage if that happens. Yeah. They're gonna get through on this shot. If I get hit all three times. No, I didn't. Nice. RNG. Carry. And now, even if the weapons get back up, I can cloak again. It's no big deal. Nice, we're gonna be good. No danger. I think they may have even pulled their captain out of the cockpit to give me a full 100% hit chance. That's nice of them. Oh boy, you're good at engines. You will be... Huh. Good at engines. Hmm. Ah. Has nothing to do with engines, but hey. Alright. Um. Oh. Goldie was good at engines, too. Well, that means uh, Eskimo Joe here is general repairs. And for now, that means he's on doors. Which is fine. Mm, yeah, I'll take that. Let's head to the store. I could use a couple bars of repair. We don't need much, but... That's a glaive beam! Mmm. That is good. We're almost to the point where we can power that as well. That is really good. I am going to grab that. That's going to be seven. Because I want to keep the chain ion going. But oh my, we have a pre-ignited glaive beam. <laughs> oh boy. Now what we could do 
is run two basic lasers and a glaive. The basic lasers do fire faster than the chain ion. The chain ion winds up being more reliable after a while. And the uh, chain ion will actually tear through more shields eventually than the glaive beam will, I think. Uh, carefully cut the ship out. Nice. Oh, dear. Oh, wait. I might be able to hit that quest marker. That'd be great if I could. Uh, we'll do this. Oh dear. See, I could do a glaive and a basic one, or one basic. That would probably be the best current strategy that I can actually afford to do. But, like, if I could afford it, I would want to do... I would want to max out my weapons and actually use the chain ion and the pre-ignited glaive beam. Oh, shit. I wasn't paying any attention, damn it. Well, oh no. Well, either way, we're gonna have to fight at the exit, so we may as well hit the quest. No real reason not to at this point. Oh, great. Hang on, this doesn't work, does it? No, it doesn't, okay. Well, why does that not Ah, it's because the first weapon is the one that gets the power, okay. Uh, let's see, we have a missile and a basic laser. And now they just have nothing, actually. <laughs> Alright, we'll keep this up. Because any other way is going to just be annoying, really. Once those weapons come back up, and there's no... I'm really into having that missile. Up. I hope you're really into not getting your efforts worth. Hmm. If it fires, we can click. We got click. Ah, uh, we still managed to get hit. That's really annoying. Don't do that. Gotta make sure I get this up fast. There we go. Alright, take out these shields. It's really annoying. Actually, the chain ion is the only thing that needs to stay on the shields. Since it won't actually do system damage, it will keep those shields down for sure. We gotta take out that cockpit, delay the FTL as much as we can, and I missed a cloak. It's one bit of hull damage I didn't need to take. Oh boy. Uh, we'll take that. And hey, we're still gonna have to fight at the exit no matter what, so may as well hit the store. Got a halberd beam. We can't run double beams. That would be dumb. Uh, I don't really need more crew right now. Uh, mind control would be nice for the um, flagship. So, I guess I'll get that. And then, I, you know what, I'm going to switch up my weapons for now. We're going to go Glaive Basic. Just because we have the pre-ignited Glaive. And basically what that means is we can get through... We can get through shields. Uh, we want to... Oh, we can't mind control. Um... 
Yeah, we'll do that. And then this will happen, but not quite yet. There we go. Okay, we've done a good bit of damage. Oh boy, we've been boarded. It's bad. Okay, we're fine. Uh, don't want to find it. If that Hermes comes towards us, we need to take it out. meant to be doing is that I have to wait for the basic laser. Or wait on the basic laser. This is why I want to power the chain ion and the glaive beam, because the basic lasers are inadequate. Okay. Let's drown them out. Ah, dear. Ah, oh, screw it. Uh, where, wait, where are they? Okay, we'll jump away. Jump to the Rebel Stronghold. I should probably buy level 2 sensors when I get the chance. I don't know what these guys are playing at. <laughs> I'll just move forward. This isn't working out too well for you guys. Whoops. Okay. Back to your stations every... Oh. Joe doesn't have a station. That's right. His name actually was changed. He is on doors, and his station will be saved. No Ion Storm, please. Thank you. Nice! We got a gold pilot. Calvin Candy, you have been demoted. Mr. Pooch is in charge. Butch. Oh boy. Oh my god. We need to escape. I want nothing to do with that. Shouldn't be an ion storm right next to an ion storm. There we go. We're good. Okay. Power that up. Power that back up. Power that back up. Go and get that. And my weapons are not ignited. Damn. Hmm. That halberd beam is going to be annoying. Eh. Actually, our glaive can work without even worrying about it. Just fire the basic laser. Oh, it's already dead. I didn't realize that thing had no shields, so there was no danger at all. Okay. Eskimo Joe, get in there. Same with you, Samson. Ah, uh, no, Samson, you're too slow. Goldie. Help Eskimo Joe. Okay, everyone back to your spots. No, 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 not you. You be on sensors. Save. Um, I'm gonna keep hitting this nebula. Just because it keeps the fleet from advancing towards me, really. Okay, that's all the nebula we're gonna get for this sector. Let's look around. Oh boy. Do this the other way. Um, we will fire here, and then we will glaive this way. Uh, no, we'll do it that way. There we go. <laughs> it's already almost dead. Oh, 
I'll save the actually mind control that guy. I'll save the uh, basic laser for when the glaive beam is almost all the way powered. And go. Nice. <laughs> Easy flagship fight. Oh boy, an Ion Blast Mark II. Oh my goodness. Alright, you guys switch positions. Take that guy out. We are absolutely switching that weapon out. That is what I needed. That is the type of thing that we go for here. Chain Ion is out of here. As soon as we can afford that, we are absolutely going for it. But the Glaive Beam is going to handle pretty much everything we need it to for a good while. Um, no, this is the way this needs to go. First, a basic laser. Cool. Uh, the basic laser didn't do it, but an asteroid did it for us. There we go. Nice and simple. Hmm. Ah, hey. Asteroid teamwork. Weapons are still what I want to, uh, they're what I want to get to. Ion Blast 2 is so insanely fast. I'm gonna make a couple jumps, a couple extra jumps before the, uh, before we hit the store. You're not going anywhere. We are going to mind control you because you're in the you're in the uh, engines. And that's the best possible thing for you to break for me. Nice. Completely delayed. Didn't even have to worry about that really. Nice. Good rewards. I think we can... We can almost afford... Almost afford the weapons upgrade to where we want to be. Uh, heavy Ion is too slow. Okay, we can get rid of that. Believe we can do with getting rid of these. Yeah, we can. Wait, uh, seven. We're currently at five, and we were maxed out, so yes. There we go. Nice. I think maybe we can make it all the way back up to the exit if we go this way. That's annoying. Okay. I'm gonna need you to move this way. And then we need to ion blast the shields. Forever. And we just do that. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah, that's a lot of fun. I'll take that. Get your men off my ship. Get out. What are you doing? Ugh. Wait. Everyone in the med bay. Uh, okay, we won't vent these rooms. Uh, I'm gonna need you to fix. 
fix that. Close that. Oxygen's on. Okay. Just want you to get some heals as well. Oh dear. Goldie, no. all the doors everybody back to your spots Eskimo Joe and Goldie get in there oops how do I not have the power do I have a Zoltan that died no medbay was turned on that's why uh, okay. I still want to upgrade weapons by one. Because if my weapons take a stray hit, that could end me. Could. Likely not going to be a huge deal. But it could. Ah, oh, dear. I don't think I have the time. I'll try. And it's not like I will be in super huge amounts of danger in the event that uh, I get hit. Like, in the event that I get trapped, I don't think I'm going to be in that much trouble. Oh, that's annoying. Just go and help him. Help out Mr. Pooch. Good? Yes, we're good. Okay. I could really use some repairs. Uh, that's gonna be close. Nah, we can't do it. I'm sorry, Quest. I have to forego you. Do this this way. Eh, no, we won't. Oh, we absolutely won't. Oh, that piloting hack is no big deal. We'll just start to take down their weapons. And then we'll be all all good. And they're gonna get peppered with asteroids anyways, so it doesn't even matter. I will be amazed if the glaive beam gets to fire again. Oh, it did. That's cool. Didn't matter much. I sort of wish when the glaive, well, when any glaive, yeah, any beam weapon fired, I wish the sprite would actually like tilt a little bit. Yeah, I made this jump, but I don't think I could have made two more. Don't need, don't need fuel. Yeah, I would have gotten, I would have gotten hit hard. Uh, we're going Mantis, I guess. Hopefully, I'm near a store. I'm still not in super huge amounts of danger every jump, but I would like to get near a store. Okay, ion blast first, then we do. Let me do that. Oh dear, we missed. That's not good. Ion intruder is bad. Okay, there we go. Uh, mantis. sensor person please handle that I will help you guys out as much as I can oxygen's off head there take care of that oh no my shields 
need a cloak. Um, I'll take that surrender. I don't want any of this hull damage happening. Calvin and Samson were the ones repairing. That means little Jody and Butch need to get some heals, and we will do the trick with them. And everyone back to your spots. Ugh. This is getting scary. Things have three shields now. Um, remotely repair. Oh god, uh, this is bad news. Uh, avoid the ship, we don't need to fight people unnecessarily. Not at this stage, at this stage we just need to not die. Okay. I will mind control one of you. Just act. Mm, yeah. We'll do that. Because if the NG gets mind controlled, he's getting hit by a mantis. If the mantis gets mind controlled, he's hitting an NG. So we're going to be good on that. And then I will uh, glaze beam this way as soon as the ion connects. And didn't connect. Oh. Goody. We need to vent that. I didn't realize there were intruders on board. I should be paying attention to the fact that they have a crew teleporter. Ah. Good. I didn't realize I had the ability to uh, fire shots now. Uh, we actually did a good amount of damage to their weapons, so I'm not in any danger. Nice. Doing a good job. Now I just have to watch for the fires on my ship. And I need to vent these guys. Uh, they're gonna. Nope, 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 nope. <laughs> you need to get out. Fast. Alright, you're fine. <laughs> you two fix this. Oh god. Run. He's gonna die, don't worry. And he's dead. Cool. Oh man, that was. We were close to losing crew there. Nope, don't need to worry about that. Just stay out of it. Alright, everybody back to your spots. Eskimo Joe, you'll get your heals in a bit. Come on, give me a store. Okay. Ion Blast there, and Glaive there. Good, connected. Nice, 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 nice. Mind control this guy so they can't be productive in any way. And we're in very little danger. Oh dear. Did not realize. Man, you are forever in danger. Oh goody. An ion bomb. That is wonderful, and that will actually be replacing the ion blast. Because, despite its long charge time, it's insane for ion damage. So, we will upgrade to that. I almost wish I could downgrade. <laughs> uh... Max out mind control as well, and we are good. I need a store really badly, though. 
That is the only thing I'm still worried about. And I forgot to charge the ion bomb. Oh dear. Okay. Oh, we're, we're still kind of alright. Luckily, we can still fire that. And we can mind control one of these guys. Luckily, we got the Mantis. And we managed to disable a couple of their weapons. Fentus Mantis. You'll go ahead. You'll be fine. Mm. I was gonna say, when either of those weapons were about to fire, we would um, immediately like, get out of there. Like, cloak. That's what I would say. Okay, you need to move, you need to go in there, we need to vent from the shields. Seems I don't like having oxygen on. Oh man, this guy's not dead. Your people are dead. Please stop what you're doing. <coughs> Oh no! We lost... We lost Eskimo Joe. I think we lost someone else, too. Oh. That's unfortunate. Well, damn. Oh, boy. Didn't quite make it. Oh well, we can ion bomb the shields, and then we can... Do this. Nice. Good bit of damage. I probably could have done with taking out those weapons, actually. But we'll just cloak away. Hmm. Yeah, I have bombs not gonna be worth it again. We'll just do this this way around. Ah, uh, no. Our cloak is going to handle their weapons, more or less. And the glaive beam's going to handle everything else, apparently. Nice. A ton of scrap. Okay. I believe... With a person maxed out on engines... That will be, uh... Thank God. Been looking for one of these forever. With a person maxed out on engines, we will actually get uh, all the way up to 100% evasion. Now that we have four engines. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Can't afford it. No reason to fill up all the way. Um, right. I'm just gonna go to the next sector. Right. I would like to get at least one more weapon to finish out this build. As it stands, we're doing all right, but we could be doing so much better. If we got like a burst laser too, that would be pretty much ideal. All right, just like before, ion bomb there. And if it hits, okay, it did hit. Yeah, that looks about ideal. Cool. If they even fire anything at us, which they did, we can just cloak, and then it's no big deal. And we can just drop the glaive beam right where we had it, and then we'll go away. Get 
get buffers for everything. I'll be jumping all the way back down to that store. Uh, let's see. Oh, I do care. Ah. I've been stalling. Jerks. It's okay, we have some evasion. Okay. Slave beam there. Or ion bomb. Then the glaive beam should do good work. Actually, oh damn, we don't have we don't have sensors really. Man, they're still coming. Nice, managed to land the other ion bomb. That's going to do a lot of damage. <laughs> oh yeah. No, I will not accept surrender from you filthy slugs. Nice. Good amount of scrap. Uh, you know what? Not now. If there's nothing good at the shop, I will upgrade my weapons one more time just to get that buffer. I'll take a drink. Ugh. Damn. One more jump. And then we got two stores right next to us. And I don't believe a burst two is a... Uh, a burst two is not very expensive to begin with, so... Um, yeah, that's going to be the way we do this. So, land the ion bomb. There we go. Good lord, the destruction. Uh... I'll take that offer. I don't think I'm going to get much more scrap than that, to be honest. I'm amazed that we got two stores in a nebula. Ugh. I don't like it. I really don't. <sighs> that combat drone. Ah, oh, the combat drone could be very good, especially in addition with our ion bomb. Yeah, we're gonna do that. Um, can't afford it quite yet. Is there anything we can sell? No, no, <laughs> no. We need what we got. As soon as I can afford it, I will upgrade the... Um, the system. Oh, actually. Oh, man. We have so many drones, too. Nice. Uh, combat drone could be nice and good. It's still not what I want. Like, that burst, too, would have been perfect. Uh, I could really do with some actual combat, please. Um, mm, I'll let you have my shields. I mean, you're gonna need yours a lot more than I'm gonna need mine. And... Doesn't really matter. Mm, they can't even decide what they want to keep going. Awesome. I could have waited for that charge weapon. Don't think it's too big of a deal that I missed the opportunity. Man, we can't hit anything with this ion bomb. It's actually kind of disappointing. Let's go this way. I'll slow him down no matter what. Eh, we're still perfectly safe. I will kill these guys. Don't do it yet. Gotta wait for the glaive. Okay. Good. Nice. Good amount of scrap. 
no, what? <laughs> what was it that I was gonna upgrade? Oh, yes. It was that. Just so we can afford to put out combat drones. Let's go this way. And I may as well use one on every single fight, because... If we can manage to land an ion bomb and hit them with, uh, hit them with the glaive beam and the combat drone, we are looking good. Oh boy, we actually managed to land the hit. Nice. Please come back. Okay. I fire. Good. Good, good, good. No surrender. The only thing that sucks is our sensors don't work in Nebulas. Uh, we'll not be firing another ion bomb. Don't need to. Oh, shit. Um, mm, they're gonna get their shields back. Okay, that's fine. Here's what we do. Damn. I should have just gone with the sure thing. Which would have been this. It's okay. Even tossing in an ion bomb right now wouldn't do anything. I'll just wait until I can fire this again. Uh. Ooh. More oxygen. My cloak is greater than your cloak by a lot. There we go. Okay. All four of you. Fix that. Oh, God. There's a hull breach as well. Okay. You need to not be in there. You get in there. Oh, damn. Uh, I'm not good at micromanagement. <laughs> that is another <laughs> power bar that we need to replace. I'm not good at games. It's okay. What was he good at? Not engines. Oh man, he was good at weapons. That was our weapons expert. <laughs> Son of a bitch. Oh well. Calvin's on weapons now. Let's suppose now you were never good at weapons. Okay. Well, damn. Uh, no. <laughs> we need to not leave that unfinished. You guys gotta fix that all the way. Now. I think the next 25 scrap I get goes to upgrading the weapons one last time. Because I really don't need to, um... I don't need to repair at a store. Because as soon as we jump into the final stand, um... We get 10 hull points for, uh, repaired. Alright, Ion Bomb, Combat Drone, and this way. Nice. Goodbye. Nice, nice, nice. Just to get that buffer. May as well do an extra jump or two if we can afford it. Nice. Like to see that damage. <laughs> can just take care of them so fast. Everybody just gets so scared of us. Handle these guys in exactly the same way. Oh no, we missed. It's okay. Mm, they'll likely not ever be under or over. Um... Oh, well. Ah, okay. You were. You're breaking our engines, jerk bag. 
to fix that. You're not doing any good on the sensors. Uh, who might do that? Okay. Oops. Uh, we can't mind control. I was trying to cloak. Okay. Nope. Uh, we need one... No, we don't. I was gonna say, we need one more, um... Oh dear. It's on fire. I was thinking we need one more, uh... Engine upgrade, but we don't. Oh, that isn't good. We need to get away from here. This is not how we die. Not right now. Okay. Here's what we do. Improved med bay. One person goes in. And with that amount of buffer, we send another person in. And we go there, you go in. Basically, we're just gonna juggle until the oxygen's fixed. And it's pretty much already on. Nice. Good teamwork. Black, uh, back where you were. Alright. Last stand. And <laughs> we got the Kestrel C unlocked. Nice. Okay. Oh, wow. We get a repair beacon in a very good spot. Now, unfortunately, as well as this is going, I honestly don't feel good about this run. Alright, we've got the combat drone going. We want an ion bomb there, and we want to be here. And we managed to connect. Come on, connect. There we go. Nice. One shot. Easy. We can repair. Unfortunately, I won't be able to hit that other repair beacon because it's now going to be covered by the flagship. So, this is what it comes down to. Just got to wait and we got to go. And I will turn my game sound up for myself for this fight. Alright, the combat drone is going to go out. The mind control is going to go on this guy. The glaive beam will be going out eventually. We will not fire the ion bomb yet because it will miss. Ah, uh, they hacked my cloaking. That's annoying, but it's not the worst thing. Okay. Good show. Awesome. Awesome stuff. Uh, we just need to... Really all we gotta do is this now. Cause I don't think they're ever gonna get their shields back up to what they need to be. Hacking my cloaking while I'm not cloaking is not even a thing. I would even say thanks for that. Nice. This is going well. Mind control that guy to keep him from ever bringing that thing back online. It's unfortunate that I don't have like a breach weapon. Yeah. That was bad timing. 
And we don't need the glaive to be firing when it can't do any damage at all. The timing is awful. And he's now got that missile launcher back online, I think. We can dodge it perfectly, which is cool. Okay. Oh, we can mind control him again. Okay. Don't auto fire that. Okay, 95%. Yeah, I figured. We gotta start landing these ion bombs. He's gonna cloak. Yeah, there we go. As soon as the cloak goes away, that's when we hit him. Okay. Oh my god, we missed. That's really bad. Like, that's... Okay, our cloak is sorted, but... Damn. That's the type of thing that makes me think it's gonna snowball out of control really fast here. Uh, you know what? We could use some repairs on that mind control. I want that guy to be able to break the shit out of that. Come on. There we go. That's what I wanted. Oh, I don't get to cloak. Okay, we got good evades. Um... Oh, no. I did that in exactly the wrong moment. That's okay. This guy is going to break his post. Okay, we're alright. We're alright. The glaive beam's gonna do it right now. Good. Alright, that was kind of ugly. Oh, the repair first. How did we manage to pull that? I'll use that. That's awesome. System damage, negative eight. That is great. We may as well power that. We've got the missiles for it. It's fixed. It's like magic. Uh, that I'm actually going to put behind everything because it could uh, <laughs> it can target the uh, it can target the weapons and like basically repair itself so I'm happy to have that there uh, that just won't be on auto fire so that's cool that may actually save us Oh, wait. Oh, we can't do that. Oh, wait. Uh, no, we don't need to. Yeah. We don't need all that. All we need is 40% of aid, so we can handle that. This is good. We can handle going after the flagship right now. And they no longer have cloaking, so this just got a bit easier. Oh. Ooh. I'm not sure that I like that. Well, we can mind control this guy and he can break his post. Then we can ion bomb the shields and we can 
<laughs> no, we will not be targeting an enemy ship with a repair bomb. That would be not good. All right, we'll do as much damage as we can. Uh, I mean, this is the damage we want to do. Damn, I forgot about that. That's not actually a huge deal, though. I can just... I can just kind of spam repair bombs at myself. I'm not too worried about that. Oh, damn. I didn't do that cloak right. It's gonna help. And the glaive beam's gonna get full damage now. Nice. The repair bomb's just gonna go there. Ooh. That's ugly. Get that off. This is not going too terribly. Just repair bomb that. Everybody's gonna need to get in the med bay, because I can't really afford to lose any of you guys. You all do actually important things. Including you, bitch. Doing alright in regards to health, though. Losing less than half health on two phases of the flagship is not exactly what I would call bad. Most certainly not. Okay, that doesn't need to be on, that doesn't need to be on, that needs to be fully powered. That's right. Well, what we can do is we can ion bomb, we can combat drone, we can glaive beam, This does as much damage as we can really hope for at the moment. Cool, that at least got through the shields. Now, the question is, where will they be going? Okay. We can mind control and he's gonna kill his friend. Nope. Whoops. That's not a big deal. Alright. No damage taken yet. Glaive beam does not need to be on auto fire. Alright. I missed... Uh, didn't miss an opportunity. There we go. Cool. Their oxygen is a bit screwed. These guys are getting vented. Oh no. Our oxygen. We got a repair bomb, we're fine. Uh glaive beam. Too worried about. Mm, okay, that 
repair bomb needs to happen there. And then we need to vent that. And they could be doing worse things than that. And I guess we can set the uh, glaive beam to auto fire here now. Uh, repair bomb. Again, they could be doing worse things. The repair bomb's gonna go there. Hey, Kestrel Cruiser victory. I did not realize the glaive was gonna do that much damage. Calvin, Goldie, Samson, and Butch. To the valiant effort of Candyland. That is the first victory we have on YouTube. And that was actually a first try victory with a Kestrel B. And I'm gonna go ahead and say that the repair bomb probably carried that. And the pre-ignited glaive beam, you know. Whatever. Anyways, I will see you guys next time.